Saul's problem is that he viewed David as being the goat. Y'all missed that. Saul's problem. All my sports fans, you know what I'm talking about. He had a problem because it looked like Saul was great, but he wasn't the greatest of all times. He wasn't the, the goat. There's many discussions. There's many discussions about who is the goat. So, some say the goat is Bill Russell. Some says the goat is Bill Russell. But you know, you know Bill Russell, 11-time NBA champion. One of the greatest ones to ever play the game. Matter of fact, the MVP award is named after Bill Russell. Some say Bill Russell's the GOAT, when then others that's in my generation say that the GOAT is who? Michael Jordan. Some say that Michael Jordan is the GOAT. Call it what you want. Six-time NBA champion. The only person to come through the league to name their shoes and then get their own brand and now football teams wearing his clothes <laughs> some say that Michael Jordan is the greatest of all time didn't have to jump to another team to still be a great champion some say that Michael Jordan is the greatest of all times but then you got another generation that comes along and says no nah, this dude on the west coast by the name of Kobe Bryant some think that Kobe is the greatest of all time and yeah, he got five championships. He, he got five. Look at what's happening. It's de-escalating every time. He got five championships. And some think that Kobe is the greatest of all time. The black mamba. He, he got this killer instincts flowing through his veins. But, but then some of y'all foolish people say that the greatest of all times is little Bron James. Three championships three teams he did change free agency the way that scored three times four times three times he, he changed it watch this so some say that lebron james is the greatest of all times but here is what's amazing to me elder shirley what's amazing to me and i knew i had to structure it this way today because of the fact that i was dealing with youth today as well What's the greatest of all times is not also recognizing that everyone that we just called great went through a major season of rejection. Follow me. I'm done. Bill Russell, greatest of all time, but he came into the league during the time of segregation. They was mad at him. They, they talked bad about him. He, sometimes he couldn't even stay with his team. Great, great 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 rejection thank you Tavares great rejection I forgot what I was gonna say great rejection and, and, then, and then even when we look at Michael Jordan My, Michael Jordan is, is phenomenal Air Jordan but his sophomore year of high school somebody was crazy enough to cut him off the team somebody had authority with no wisdom you y'all missed that somebody cut him off of a team because they couldn't see beyond his placement to see what was getting ready to take place in his life and somebody in here ought to get excited because of the fact that somebody can't see beyond where you are right now to to really tap into what you're about to become let, well, let me walk let me walk but, but but then we got but then we got 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 kobe kobe Bryant. because of the fact that y'all don't know the draft you think that he was only a Laker. Not recognizing that Kobe was drafted and quickly exchanged to the Lakers. Charlotte Hornet couldn't see the potential. So they never won a championship because they couldn't see the potential. Charlotte Hornet traded him, watch this, for Vladi Divox. Y'all don't even know who he is. They traded him for Vladi Divox to the Charlotte Hornets because they couldn't see his potential. Kobe was rejected. And then we turn around and we got little Bron James. You like that name? Little Bron. Little Bron James. Little Bron James is still trying to figure out who really is his father. His father never 
ever really showed up. It's been rumored about three different guys. Which one might be his dad? And all of them want to claim him now because he's arrived, but nobody wanted to claim him when he was building up. And even though I'm not a fan of LeBron James, let me just say this. I am a tremendous fan of his work as a man. Watch. But LeBron James, too, he experienced rejection. So when we talk about the GOAT, the GOAT is not about how you win. The GOAT is about how you endure. When we talk about the GOAT, don't watch this. When we talk about the GOAT, because here becomes the problem. The problem is that Saul is elected to be their leader. They want him. They requested him. David is prophesied to be their leader. Y'all missing me. And so now Saul is having a problem because of the fact that the people have laid their mouth now on David even after God had already spoken over him. And so now he's having a problem with who's the real goat here? Who, who's the real goat here? Who's the greatest of all time here? And the reality is Saul, you stepped over your territory. Because here you go thinking that you are the greatest of all time and you discounted that you nor David is the real goat. The real goat is named Jesus. For Jesus is the greatest of all time because he gave life to everybody. I need somebody in this house right now to open your mouth and celebrate the real goat.